hi friends welcome back to my channel today i'll be showing you how i color my weave at home this is l'oreal paris color vista as you can see is in the color blue black so that is the color i'll be working with today so here is one of my old weave which i've changed the color about three times yeah this will be the third time i'll be changing the color of this hair so the old color is in cherry red I'll be changing it to blue black today to have a new look so I went ahead and put on my gloves to avoid it from staining my palms and as you can see I have already covered my table with a poly bag to avoid stains too so here is the L'Oreal Paris color Vista in blue black so this is the developer that came with it here is the developer so it also has a conditioner here is the conditioner that came with it and of course the coloring gel it has a coloring here is the coloring gel which i'll be missing later on with the developer to change the color of the hair so i went ahead and put the developer uh, yeah, I mixed the coloring gel with the developer together So I gave it a good shake To enable it mix very well Before using it on the weave So I covered the developer and shake it really really well Before starting the coloring <laughs> giving it a good shake I went ahead to apply it to my weave as you can see so I apply it just like so to the weave and I decide to use my hands to work the, the the mixture into the hair so I continue to use my fingers to work the mixture into into the hair and adding more mixture to it yeah hair dye i call my hair dye the mixture so i continue to add the mixture to it using my fingers to work it into the hair and i continue in this direction adding the mixture and working it with my fingers to enable it uh, dye very well and i'll add more mixture to the hair and continue in the same direction using my finger to work it right in so yes this is how i do it continue to add my mixture to it and using my big tooth comb to comb it out first of all i use my finger to work it in and use the big tooth comb to comb the hair to allow the mixture go into the hair
you can see the one I, I did first has already changed as you can see it has already changed but I still went ahead to leave it for about 15 minutes before washing out the the dye yeah I just continued to comb it and yeah ahead and double my weave because I like to use it to make a wig so I double the weave together this is how I double my weave on a sewing machine if you like to see more on how I make a wig on a sewing machine I'll leave the link on the description box below so I double the weave before sewing my wig so I went on this same direction making the weft journey together using the zigzag method on my sewing machine so the description on how to sew your wig make a wig with a sewing machine i will leave it on the description box below <laughs> why i started making my wig i have already lined out my cap my wig cap where i will be placing my weave before sewing it as you can see i traced out lines on the cap before sewing the weave to the wig cap so this wig i'm making right here is a wig without a closure so if you like to see more please comment on the description box below on how i made this wig
color vista in blue black from l'oreal paris look like and this wig right here i made it without a closure if you want to know more details on how to make a wig on a sewing machine without a closure please comment on this comment section below and the l'oreal paris color vista i will also leave the link on the description box below please subscribe to my channel if you like to see more diy please subscribe and put on your notification bell please don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you find this video interesting thank you all till next time love you